hope you're all good thank you for tuning in and for coming back if it's your first time here please click the subscribe button you will never regret that decision support your girl anyways as you can see from the title today we are doing apartment tour and i'll be showing you my bedroom where i sleep where i rest where i make those dreams and where everything great happens by everything great i mean you all know <laughs> i'm joking in my bedroom that's where i do my studying that's where I'm, i do my journaling that's where everything great dreams everything that's where it happens yeah guys so i hope you enjoy the video and i'll be showing you everything i'll be telling you the prizes and i hope you will learn how to decorate your own bedroom on a budget as you know i'm just a simple person and i believe in affordability live the life you afford and with the little money you have you can also live large that's what i'll be showing you guys please don't forget to subscribe don't forget to comment and don't forget to engage with me thank you for tuning in enjoy the video okay now we are going to the bedroom are you ready are you ready for these guys bedroom guys that's the bedroom okay so it's a very small room but what we have to know is it's very small and lovely so this is my bed it's not big at all guys it's just a three-quarter bed but i'll make i make it lovely it's a three-quarter so guys uh, let's start with the color combinations of this room. My color combinations are gray and white. Those are the colors. As you can see, oh, we start with the pillows. The pillows, I bought them, all of them, from Mr. Price Homes. Two of them, and the prizes are still there. So let's check. I kept the prizes for you guys. Kept them. So this is the price of each of these pillows, the big ones. I bought them in January and I know they are still there. So I don't know if the prices have gone higher or not. So I bought these when I moved in Mr. Price Home. So this is the price of one pillow. So I bought two. So guys, for this one, I'm sorry. I seem not to find the prices. I looked for the price tag inside. So maybe it seems like I threw it away, but it's fine. Let's look for this small, this one. I think the price is there. So I'm sorry guys, those ones, I don't know how much they weigh, but please go and check Mr. Price home. Okay, this one I found, this is the price for this nice small scatter cushion. So the price, as you can see, it's written 129 However, when I bought it, it was on sale. So the price I bought it with is 89 rands 99 So it was on special. So I don't know if the pillows are still there or if they are still on special or whatever. But when I bought it, it was 89 rands 99 And these two, I'm sorry, I don't remember the prices. So guys, that's it about our pillows. That's it. All of them from Mr. Price Warm. So now I'm going to the duvet. What do you call this? Uh, duvet um, cover. So the duvet cover, um, it's from Sheet Street. However, uh, I don't know the price because it was a birthday gift from my friend. Uh, my friend from Investor Forty last year when we were in Varsity, she bought me this as a birthday present, but I know she bought it from Sheet Street because it has a Sheet Street track on it. And I love it, you know. She knew my favorite color. So then as for this throw, I bought it at Game, And I bought it two years ago. So the price of this throw or fleece, 
I think when I bought it, it was 120. It came, it's a double bed throw and it's very be like it's warm. You can see the material. So check out game guys, they have quality stuff. But my bed, it's a three quarter, like I said. It's it's fine. I'm managing, like I, no complaints. So the main reason why I bought a three quarter bed is because uh, my room is very small as you can see very small room it's very small it's not that small but it's small for me i love space so i saw that if i bought a double bed it was gonna fill the whole space because this is a three quarter let's say it was a double bed so maybe it was gonna end here and I'll only be left with this small space. So I, I love space. I would rather have space and sleep on a three-quarter bed. Plus, I'm single, guys. So, you know, there's no need. I don't have a husband or what. So a three-quarter for one person, I think it's fine. Plus, I spend most of my life at a boarding school. And also, my university, I was staying in university, so I was sleeping on a single bed. So it's fine. Now we are moving over to the side table. So, guys... This is my side table. I love it. That's my side table. I hope you can see it clearly. Like, it's just amazing. So this side table, guys, um, I I found a carpenter. You know, I'm, <laughs> I'm a DIY person, you know. DIY means do it yourself. So I had a design which I wanted in my head. But because I'm not a carpenter, I had to look for someone to do it for me. So we did it together. I did the design, then the carpenter did the assembling. So guys, I went on Marketplace. I saw a carpenter. Then I found this person. And they did a good job. And this person who did this side table is the person who did my... If you remember the TV stand, this is the person who did it. So if you want to see my TV stand, I also designed my TV stand. I knew what I wanted and I told them, I told him the idea I had in my mind. And the person who did the side table is the person who also did this dressing table for me. So the carpenter is really good. And as you can see, the handles, they complement with my wardrobe. So everything and the colors are complementing each other. My TV stand. Go ahead and check out my living room tour. You will see. So from this, guys, you will learn that sometimes you don't really have to go to a big fancy shop to come up with something great. Because you have to know that those uh, things from the furniture shops, they are also made by carpenters. So you can as well design it yourself and just look for a carpenter to do it for you. You see? And it's high quality because the wood... You will be aware of the kind of wood and kind of material you'll be losing and you buy your quality material so for this side table from the material the paint and everything and the assembling it only costed me 500 so imagine how much i was gonna pay if i bought it from a shop and this is a nice side table guys and it's huge like it complements everything it's huge so guys then i didn't show you here so on top we have our diffuser I bought this uh, from uh, Pep Home. Uh, it's very nice. Like, it's almost finished because I bought it in February, but it's still there. It smells good. Then this is um, a candle. So, this one smells good. So, if you light it, the room will smell nice. So, I bought this candle from Sheet Street. Guys, it smells good. Trust me. Then... This mirror, I just love it because it's white and it just gives that look and it complements everything. So this mirror, I bought it from Pep, Pep Home. So I use it for decoration and sometimes when I want to do my makeup. So I love the mirror from Pep Home. And guys, this portrait is also from Pep Home, but... You know that I, I prefer words of motivation. So I printed the words of motivation myself and I bought this picture frame or a portrait from Pep Home. And I love the color. It's white and silver. So you know silver and gray, they go hand in hand together. And above all, I love the words. 
like it reads girl get up and try again what more would you want guys it's motivation itself then this lamp guys i bought it at shield street i think the price is still there yeah you see it was 179 so it's not expensive so that's my side lamp then the bulb i bought it at mr uh, mr price check mr price and paper i don't remember but it was below 50 rand so guys this lamp why i chose it since i said my theme is white and gray i thought silver it can complement with gray then i love the white part then you see this is also the portrait it's silver and white so they complement each other so that's my side table guys that's how it's looking at the moment and i love it so now guys we are moving to my side uh what do you call this the dressing table so this dressing table guys like i said it was custom made for me i designed it myself and i told the person what i wanted so what i had in mind since you know my room doesn't have space i just wanted something which i can use as a study table as well as a dressing table because i love makeup guys so i wanted the mirror so this mirror you see it's very huge and very clear so when i'm doing my makeup i sit here and i use my makeup then like all my toiletries everything is there and my makeup stays here let me just show you those are my makeups my makeup bag everything my toiletries and the mirror is here so another thing i use this i use this as a study table or also my workstation the reason why i love it you see it's a desk so it's also a, 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 a desk my workstation my study area the reason why i love it is when i'm studying imagine studying and looking yourself on the mirror guys it gives you motivation like when all hope is lost i'll just say girl get up work be serious so that's why i love it so it's my study desk and as well you see that's why it has many shelves also my uh this is my textbook like i'm studying a master's in environmental law so i just removed some of the books because i'm not using them this semester this is the only book i have for this semester so my books they stay here then my toiletry stays here it complements each other it's a two in one like i said it's a study desk as well as um a dressing table so that's why we have the toiletries and that's why we have the books then remember i said my laptop and my school bags they stay there so guys okay so the price i bought this dressing table for 900 rands like i said i found a carpenter who did it for me i just told him i want a dressing table and also a study table and also since my room is small i needed something with storage so we have a little storage there's this cupboard there's this cupboard there's this cupboard and there's this cupboard so it's a lot of storage here i, st I store most of my stuff it's also huge then it was just 900 rands everything guys 900 rands so this was 900 rands and this was 500 rands then as for the nice chair it's a foldable chair guys that's my chair it's a study chair so this chair it's foldable that's how you fold it so guys i love this chair because sometimes i don't want there to be something so i can put this chair behind here like i store it there and sometimes i can put it under the bed so guys i bought this chair so guys i bought this chair at mr price home so it was 400 rands imagine nice chair and it's white i loved the fact that it's white and since we are also complaining about space whenever i'm not using it it won't be here i can put it under the bed or behind there i fold it it's 400 rands at mr price home then now we are moving to my favorite place in the room so in this room guys my favorite is this mirror like i bought the mirror 
um it was on facebook marketplace but i saw them at mr price home so mr price home is your plug i think it's 300 rands it's those mirrors which are supposed to hang by the door but they even it even has a hook so it's supposed to be hanged by the door but i didn't hang it because when i moved into this apartment i realized that i already had the mirror so there's no need of me hanging it here because i already had the mirror in the room so that's why i put it here so this mirror i use it for dressing up like when i'm going to school after i've bathed like my wardrobe is here so when i dress up I just come and see myself, then I go. So I love it. It's very lovely. And I love the fact that it's white. So it complements everything. Then this is another mirror station. And I love it, guys. Huh? Look at us. Me seeing myself. Yo, guys, then this thing, I'm not proud of it. I'm not proud of it at all. This is my laundry basket. Look how full it is. The thing is, guys, I haven't bought a washing machine yet because I haven't found the money to spare and buy a washing machine. So, wash, for now, it's winter, guys. And I wash my clothes by hand. So, imagine how cold it is. Hi, I can't wash them. I'll wash after winter. Yo, I don't want my hands to freeze. So this is my washing basket. Yo, it's below 200 rands. Go and check Sheet Street. Then the last thing is this built-in cupboard. That's my wardrobe. Unfortunately, guys, I won't be showing you what's inside because the video is long now. I think I'll do a, another video just showing you what's inside the wardrobe. And I'll be showing you what's inside there. And I'll be showing you how i organize everything. so guys i hope you enjoyed the video thank you for tuning in and thank you for watching please don't forget to subscribe please support your girl and thank you oh before i go guys i forgot to show you something i forgot to show you my curtain and my carpet okay so guys this carpet same same story with the white one in the living room area i bought this carpet at makula shop Makula shop, I don't know what you call them. My friends, those my friend guys, or Makula, or a China shop, or a China mall. It was 120. Same, same. I bought it in the same shop with that white carpet in the living room area. And I love it, guys. Like, it's very warm. You wouldn't complain. It's very warm. It's just that it's cheap. And I know you guys, you don't like cheap stuff, but it's fine. 120. Then my curtains. Um... Uh, this less i bought it at sheet street and honestly i don't remember the price but i think it's the same material when i did my sheet street vlog with that other less i bought for my uh living room you can check sheet street vlog you might see the price is the same thing as well as the curtain this one is just gray that other one is white so it's the same thing so as you know our colors are gray and white so i just wanted gray that's what i use so guys that's it let's do our proper bye byes bye guys thank you for tuning in bye guys thank you for tuning in i hope you enjoyed the vlog please subscribe don't forget to comment bye bye Bye. Bye.